So a few things have changed while you guys were out. First things first, I loaded a bunch more mods, so for starters, the marketplace here actually has, you know, merchants in it. I've got gas-powered lanterns, hungry bandits have different types of weapons, and stuff like that. I also had to do an import, so a lot of stuff is kind of reset, but nothing major, like my uh, discovered location is still the same, factual relations are still the same, nothing has really changed all that much, but if, say, I go into here, there's going to be different people there, but specifically, I want to talk to that guy, because he's here now. Now that NPCs are just roaming around the map. Another free follower. And the best part about him is he's got a sleeveless dust coat, which gives you a martial arts bonus. Now, I don't need that as much as I wanted it before, because I got the ninja rags, which gives you a bunch more bonuses than just that. So, he's going to be sticking with this, and Hobbs is going to be sticking here. Now, as for what Alex was doing, he was working on a thief training box. So his thievery stat is up to like 19. I was trying to get it up to 20, but it's just going to take freaking forever. So he's also got a large backpack. And we're going to head up to stack and start stealing stuff while Hobbs... Well, Hobbs is going to get to work on the home team, busting up them rocks. While Alex goes and tries to make some money. Because, I mean, we've got like 87,000 cats, which is which is a good amount of money. But, you know, like I keep saying, money goes really fast in this game. If I've had, you know, nearly half a million cats, and I've spent it all in a matter of minutes trying to buy gear. Which is where theft comes in. Because you can steal all kinds of good shit. Wait, what? Oh, yeah, those guys are after my food. Yeah, you can always go back and check the dialogue. Now, interestingly enough, if they're not hostile towards you, you can actually drop food, and they'll like you for it. I didn't do that this time. Alright. So another thing you'll notice is that, uh, these guys have shields now. And some of the bandits have shields too. Bandits also have things like, well, bandits and these guys have daggers, long swords, and stuff like that. They have more knight looking shit. And a bunch of random dialogue I got updated. So let's go ahead and buy some meat. There's nothing like trying to steal stuff and your guy just just walks out because he's hungry. Let's see, while this while we're waiting for the sun to go down, let's see about what's in the bars here. I wonder if any of these places are just regular houses, and I don't think they are. No, okay, that place is. Meow. Eh, Meow just looks like a randomly generated person. Oh yeah, he can uh, do that anime run now. Alright, this is going to be the place I have to rob. I could start out trying to rob a store or something, but since I only have like 20 stealth, or 20 thievery, if I fail, I basically get kicked out of that shop for good. But this person has like minor stuff I can get. Provided I come back while they're asleep. We're just going to wait for the sun to go down, and then we'll pick this up then. Alright, the sun should be going down any minute now. I'm going to head bringing Hobbs up here, and I gave him the, the huge backpack so he can, you know, hold all the shit we're going to steal. Not that there's going to be a whole hell of a lot inside there. I'm just going to keep an eye on the businesses to see when they close. It's usually around 2200, I think. That'll also give Hobbs more time to get here. Ah, there he is. And there goes the sun sunset. Alright, showtime. Oh. Eh, 
That almost ended poorly. Oop, still might. Okay, let's try that again. Oh, they got me. We're just gonna get the hell completely out of here. And, damn. That did not go well. Well, since that didn't work, we're gonna go try to raid one of those farms over there. And, Hobbs, you catch up when you can. Hopefully these people won't mind too much. And at least while I'm actually in their territory, or not super sure how it works. Some bounties only disappear if you're in the territory in question. Some bounties don't disappear at all. The guards will care, but they don't. Go ahead, move along. He's still up here. I don't think he's going to give me much trouble. Well, let's see what we got. Well, first off, let's close that door. Okay, we're progressing. None of this stuff is particularly valuable, but it will help us get some experience. I don't particularly want any of that stuff. Oh, that person's still awake. Shit. Alright. Let's just get out of here. And Hobbs should be here soonish. There he is. Just gonna go ahead and dump all this stuff on him. It looks like they're fighting some river raptors over here or something. Hmm. Not really sure what they were fighting. Let's just take a peek in here. We'll probably regret it, but let's just take a peek. I don't know why those were indoors. Okay, there's nobody in here, so... Well, no, there's somebody. But if you... Oof. If something has a 100% chance of being stolen, you don't get any bonus... You don't get any experience from stealing it, so... No risk, no reward. Go somewhere, you busybodies. Hobbs, you go close that door. And I don't think that thing can technically see me. Alright, who the hell is fighting out here? Oh, random bone dog. I'm gonna have Hobbs go, go loop that. Just take all that stuff. And 50 50 shot for stealing from this thing. Oh, no, you, you stay. Alright, we got it. Holy shit, no, river raptors. Yeah, this is a good a time as any. To get some combat training in. Or so I thought. Huh. Wonder if I can turn that in. <laughs> Let's find out. There was a, a jail cell in here. Let's see if I can turn him into there. Oh, 
Holy shit. <laughs> That's awesome. Yeah, there's another box up here. Yeah, it doesn't look like it's it's doesn't look like being here is considered trespassing. Nobody's telling me to leave. I mean this is just a farm, but Yeah, we'll take it. It doesn't look like there's anything else up here to take. What? Oh, this must be that recruitable prisoner's mod in action. Yeah, no, we, we don't need any river raptors. Yeah, we, we don't need that. Huh, looks like he's gonna be in prison for the next ten hours, though. And while I don't think these things have anything worth taking, let's take a look. Okay, yeah, they have animal skins, but we don't particularly need that as we're not that low on money. So since uh, I think these items will respawn when the day does, but in the meantime, in the meantime, let's get back to the Shinobi Thieves and pawn this crap. So there was a little bit of a bone dog incident just outside a stack, but apparently these guys don't really care about Alex's bounty. They, well, I guess with it being so low and without, uh, you know, any real negative faction penalties going on right now, they just don't care, so... Alex can probably just walk on through town without any actual issues. So let's go ahead and loot those real quick. And let's get on in here. In fact, because those injuries are gonna slow Alex down. See, he's he's got a negative penalty to stealthy to his injuries. We're gonna go ahead and have him jump in a bed real quick. Just just get in there, buddy. And Hobbs is going to hang out in here. Let's see, I think I have a fireplace. Yeah, so we can cook this food. Now, where was that other house? Here it is. That's right, we're going back to the same one. We're going to try to clean that place out again. Hmm. Let's go ahead and... Grab more of this stuff. Okay, well, we're up to like a... 60% chance to steal stuff. His thievery has gone... It's up to 23, so that's not bad. I don't know what the actual rate for stealing these things is, but it seems to be pretty high while also giving me decent experience. We're gonna try this. And it failed. And here we go again. Hobbs, you stay out of it. Alex, why don't you just run? <laughs> and Hobbs, you again, you just stay out of it. Pretty typical day. Pretty typical day. Like I think, I think, yeah, I think he can almost stealth run faster than they can normally run. All right, so. Yeah, that bounty is gonna climb for a little bit. Now there's another location over this way. It's not a civilian outpost. It's a it's a mine. There we go. And that's where the Holy Nation has some of its slaves carry out their work. It's a decent place to stop off if you've got you know people with bounties you want to turn in. 
which we can actually do with Alex. Make ourselves a little bit of money. In fact, yeah, let's do that. Let's have Hobbs get over here. Now the problem is, if we turn Alex in here, he'll get sold into slavery. Whereas if we turn him in there, he'll just be, you know, a prisoner. So let's go ahead and walk him back over there, especially with the sun coming up. So we made a little progress. We're still not really nearly good enough to steal any good weapons or anything, but we made some progress. Who's still after me? Oh well. Let's go ahead and pick him up. And we're just gonna... We're just gonna turn him in. What the hell happened here? Oh. More bone dogs. Well, Alex, <laughs> it looks like you're gonna be spending another couple of days in jail. And I mean, why, why shouldn't we get the money for it? You know? It's not like we need it, but why not? Those are just regular old paladins. There's the Inquisitor. Or there are Inquisitors. Where's the main guy? Dude who sits on that. I thought he was the one we turned people into, but I think I can just put Alex in here and it'll be fine. Hmm? Okay, maybe not. Hobbs, if you would. Ah, uh, hmm. Okay, well, it looks like he'll carry out the rest of his sentence. We're not gonna try to bust him out of there, though. That, uh, I don't see that ending well. You know what? Fuck it. Let's, let's do this. Okay, so Alex let himself out. And now he's leaving. And now they're after him. So let's, let's just run up there. Let, let's <laughs> just get him out of town. Oh shit, I made it worse. Expires in a hundred thousand hours. Yeah. We're not gonna hang out. We're, we're, we're just, fuck. I, I did make it worse. I was trying to cash in on that bounty and I just made it worse. So we're gonna, instead, yeah, there's a couple other towns around here. We're actually gonna go back to the hub and we're just gonna hang out there and make some money there, at least till this bounty wears off. While it seems that I can go ahead and run around their cities and everything with just this low level bounty, I'd rather not get it so bad that he's assaulted on sight.